Oh hey, didn't see you there. These are my top 5 quick ways to improve at Halo 4. And I know there's more than just these 5, but these are the ones I've chosen, so let's go! Number 5, turn off the music. Nothing is worse than trying to listen to the sounds of your opponent's footsteps, only to be interrupted by the non-stop blasting music of Halo 4. They didn't give us an option to turn it off, so we got innovative. Rip an MP3 to your hard drive from a CD, or take a USB thumb drive with an MP3 on it. Navigate over to the media blade on your dashboard, and from there, select the song followed by the pause button, and then breathe a sigh of relief, finally some peace, and now you will be hearing those footsteps in every game. Number 4, disable vibration. Now, vibration self-explanatory. You don't need to control or wiggling and jiggling in your hands when you're trying to achieve accuracy. More so, the vibration stresses the player out. The closer you are to death, the more of a palm massage you're getting. Do yourself a favor and turn that thing off. There are visual cues on screen to let you know everything in-game, and if you disagree with me, as I know there's a few sticklers out there, no mouse and keyboard has vibration. Competitive PC shooters rely all on the information on screen to make their choices. By turning vibration off, you achieve less stress, greater accuracy, and you begin to read the information on screen. Number three, this one's easy. Warm up! Even if it's just running around a map and firing the weapon a few times, warming up will increase your success when just starting a session immensely. You familiarize your brain with the movement and the sticks and the motion. I've seen a lot of pros warm up during reach days and sometimes it's just as simple as shooting a few boxes and running around. You decide the length, could be a minute, could be five, could be ten, but I would always rather be familiar with the sticks before hopping into matchmaking cold. Number two! Watch your replays. I've said this for over a year, watch your replays. There's no faster way to improve in Halo than trying to watch back your games. Watch your losing games, figure out what went wrong, how you can play differently next time. Watch your winning games, see what you did right, share it with your friends and enjoy that sweet victory. Watch everything. I cannot stress this enough, watch your replays. You're gonna improve, boom. And my number one quick way to improve in Halo 4 is playing the Octagon with friends. There is no faster way to warm up and polish your gunfighting skills than the Octagon. Octagon is a circular map that is available for free on the file share where you and friends can practice gunfighting skills continuously. If you spend 20 minutes in here every single day you play, your shot, your strafe, and your gunfighting skills are going to go through the roof. Not to mention, it's pretty fun. You set it up in custom games, you search for the map in the file share, it's called the Octagon, and it is going to take you to the next level. I'm BBK Dragoon. I know there's more than just these five tips to give, but these are the ones that I constantly remind myself of while playing Halo 4. If you have other quick tips that weren't mentioned here, you can tell me down below, and I'll read it, and maybe it'll appear somewhere in the future! So good luck out there on matchmaking, folks, and I will talk to you later. BBK Dragoon is out.